Hey everyone, this is my walkthrough on the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Whoa. <laughs> it's getting all willy in here. Yes, anyways, we're playing Ocarina of Time. Uh, right now we are in the middle of the Forest Temple. That's what we did in the last video. We started it, and we're going to continue this time. So anyways, in this twisted, tor this twisted corridor, it'd be a really good idea to use Ferrar's Wind. Um, I kind of didn't really want to get it, because I knew you guys like, but well, you need this. So this is why it'd be a good idea to actually pick it up, because Ferrar's Wind, uh, you place it there, we can warp back there anytime we want. It's a really good idea to do that, mainly because we're going to be coming back to that room a lot. Trust me on that. Uh, but anyways, yeah. Uh... Oh god, we're gonna have to do this. This fight is coming up. Damn it, I hate this fight. We're gonna have to do a fight coming up, and I hate this fight. I suck at it. Because I am underprepared! But I have a fairy with me, so I should be okay. Uh, there's nothing we can do about that right now. As much as I would like to. Well, we'll be able to do something about it really soon, but uh, for now, we move forward. Oh, hold on. Well, I'm gonna place that there and see. I don't know if they do anything later on. I don't know. Anyways, look what we have. It's a Stolfos. Oh, damn it. Uh, now, be very careful. See this guy? He can walk over this gap. You cannot. You will fall and you will die and people will laugh at you. So, just don't do that. Uh, okay, this, this is probably one of the most annoying fights I consider in any of the... What the hell? Dude! Oh, cool, I got a heart. Which I'm probably going to lose like in five seconds. I freaking hate Stolfos. They are like one to me. They are one of the most annoying enemies in this game. Come on, dude! You're taking too many hits. Just kill the freaking guy. All right, there we go. Come on, one more, more blow should do him. Come on, dude! Oh boy, I better not die. Oh no! Don't don't kill me, please. Can I kill you? Dude, come on. This is my adventure. This is not Adventures of Stolfos. Thank you. Now, now this platform's going to lower, and two more are going to appear, as if one was not enough for me. Yeah. Uh, the sucky thing about this, guys, is, um, like I was saying before, since we have two Stolfos now... Oh, shit. Um, basically, if you kill one, and it's just he's going to turn into a pile of bones. Uh, basically, what happens is that if you don't kill the other one in time... The other one will respawn, so literally this fight could last a long ass time. I remember the first time, I this is like the first place where I died. So, uh... uh dude. Maybe bombs will be safe. Din's fire doesn't work. Maybe bombs will. Probably not. I don't know. Uh, but what you can do is just, you can switch. Which is what I usually do, so like, I'll, I'll go to one and then I'll go to the other one. Oh, son of a bitch, where's the other one? There we go. So just do like one blow of damage to each. There we go. Whoa. Dude. I don't want to fight you, I want to fight your friend. I want to be sleeping with your girlfriend. Okay. Ugh. There we go. Yeah, this, this is going to work. So this is what I usually do with this fight, is that you just alternate. So that way, until that way, when they're both, they're both only gonna need like one more hit. So you don't have to waste so much time. Here we go. Whoa! Oh my god, I might actually die. Oh, dude, 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 don't die. Oh my god. Oh, do you know what? I'm, I'm gonna have to use it. Shit. I can always leave and go get more at that fairy candle. Okay, hold on, wait. Hold on, guys. Time out. All right, time in. I didn't really want to use that fairy, but do you know what? I kind of have to. I'm not ashamed. I'd rather, I'd rather use the fairy and live to kill these freaking bastards. Than, oh my god, I, I gotta kill this guy quickly. Dude, no. I'm, I'm just gonna... Dude, come on. Let me kill you. Let me kill you. Yeah! I'd rather use that fairy and kill those guys than die. There is nothing dishonorable about using the fairy. But anyways... It's a good idea, because guess what? We get a really good item from these guys. I'd be really pissed if we didn't. What did we get? We got the fairy bow. Basically, this is like the adult version of the fairy slingshot we got. Uh, I consider the arrows to be a lot better. So now, instead of a slingshot, we got a bow and arrow. Yes, that's right. We get to master archery. 
So what we're going to do now is we're going to use Furore's Wind. Oh, wait. Oops. I'm going to do that. I'm not sure. Why not. Um, eh, might as well have it on there. Uh, sure. Okay. We're going to use Furore's Wind. And we're going to cast it and return back to the warp point. Uh, Furore's Wind is not needed at all for this Let's Play. So, honestly, if you did not get it here, it, it's perfectly fine. But you, that just means you'd have to backtrack back to here. But if you did get it, this will definitely help. I'm just, I'm just telling people you don't have to get it. Don't, don't feel bad if you did. Because I've gone through, I've gone through here. Um, then again, I guess it, maybe if this is your first time playing through the Forest Temple, I would get it. Because you're gonna be pretty, uh, you might be pretty lost. Because this place is pretty confusing. That, that is maybe the one major flaw of the Forest Temple is that it, it, it gets really confusing. There is a lot of puzzles and stuff. But anyways, now, see that eye right there? Well, remember what we did with the slingshots? We just shot the eye. Well, that's what we do with the arrow. It makes this a lot easier. There we go. And now this untwists the hallway. So instead of just going off to the curvy way, we can now go the straight way. Because no one likes curves. Alright. And... If we drop down here, be careful. There is a uh, wall master down here. Wall masters, or a floor master, I remember. One of them, whatever, they're both really annoying. They get annoying later on in the game, too. What did we get? We got the boss key. Uh, the boss key is basically like the small keys, but instead, there is a, a door that will be blocking your way into the boss room. Uh, that's what opens up basically. Okay, that was a full boss. Thing. Basically, that's how you get into the boss. Ooh. Oh, ooh, cool. I didn't get hurt, really. Uh, yeah, be careful about blue fire, because, uh, in later on games, uh, like, the blue fire will jinx you. And you won't be able, to, uh, like, to use your sword or use items. It gets really annoying. Alright, uh, but now since we killed that guy, we go into this room. I forgot. Okay. Oh, yeah. Alright, I know I am. We're just above that one room. Okay, let's kill this. Oh, whoa. Come on, let me kill you. Oh, no! You don't get your ass. Oh, no, no. Don't fall off. You don't fall. <laughs> Can't have nice things! Can't have nice things! Great, now I have to backtrack all my way back. Go, Rate! Mark my words, big deck of the Baba Boca Boofy, whatever your name is, I don't care. I will get my revenge on you and your brethren. Stupid freaking Venus flytrap little ass. I don't know. Oh boy, I'm okay. okay, well now we have to backtrack all the way back, uh, which means we'll probably get to hear the sped up voice again. Yay! Uh, yeah, I, I like comments that people actually like that, so yeah. I've also got a comment that uh, you guys actually like my new catchphrase, can't have nice things. So why do you guys like it? Um, that comes, I guess I could explain it, but I'd have to explain it really slowly. So basically, the joke for can't have nice things came from school because me and my friend Charlotte were both having a bad day. And instead of being all emo, uh, when she asked me what was wrong, I just basically said to her, well, you know, today, apparently, I can't have nice things. I don't know where I got it. Probably from American Dad. Oh look, these pods have quills of air bundles of air. I know what I said. Arrows and magic and three. Ooh, cool, a heart. I like. I love heart. I love soup. But I'm not as much as I love soup. Yeah, uh, but anyways, uh, during our class that we have together, American Sign Language. Yes, because I sign. Uh, I'm because I have deaf relatives. Uh, basically. I forgot to do something, uh, turn in some homework, because I have English to take care of, because I hate my English teacher, and he's not clear on what to do, because he's too busy talking about preparations for college. What the hell? So anyways, after I uh, saw that, I just looked at her and said, Get out my face! And then she replied, Get out my face! So that is our joke now. So now you get to brag I can't have my face Um, And then what's really funny is that, like, almost literally, like, a week later, I heard it on American Dad. So I'm like, well, <laughs> well, great. Which I never, I honestly don't watch that show at all. You know, to be honest, I don't really like really anything Seth MacFarlane does anymore. Like, when it comes to Simpsons or Family Guy, I'm more of a Simpsons person. I love that show. I don't know, for some reason, it just never gets old. The show's been around for a long time. I mean, it's been around since, like, 1989. Jeez. Old freaking show. Oh, boy. I'm pretty much just right now, um, writing for magic, because I really like some more magic. Um, let's see, what else do I talk about? We should be back soon. Um, wait a minute, I just realized something. Dude, I could have just done this from the beginning. Wow. Apparently, I still can't have nice things, because I forgot that. If you have just used for War's Wind, so just warp back here. Oh my god, I'm not. Alright, well, at least I got to explain some stuff. Oh, wait, oh, wait, I don't know if I'm going that way. Shoot, I'm going to have to go back. Why is it twisting? Well, we get to go back. Woohoo! This is trippy! It's. Uh, the hallway seat. The hallway seat's falling. No, he's getting me. Oh god, I hate that movie. I really do. Like, honestly, that is like one of my least favorite movies of all time. Disney movies. I just, like, if I'm going to watch a Disney movie, I'm going to watch an animated one. Uh, 
Uh, okay, I had a lot of kids that didn't make me down, even though this one's my favorite. Uh, a box and a half was one of my favorite ones when I was a little kid, because it made people cry. I'm trying to think of another one. I really don't... There, there's a lot. I mean, there's seriously a lot. Um, actually, uh, recently I saw, kind of like the end of one of the movies I saw, which was We're Back, like a dinosaur story. I love that movie when I was little. Oh man, that was a great movie. Uh, what else was a good movie? Um, is there an invisible wall there? What the hell? Uh, I'm just gonna dive in the hole. Alright, we should be... Yeah, we're pretty much right back where we started. Why did I do... Why did my cast for Wars win in the first place? Okay, big Dr. Bob Loki, I'm going to kill you now. I just feel so stupid that I wasted all that time now. Alright. I want my revenge for wasting all that time. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. There we go. Ooh, and I get a Deku stick. Hey, look. There's hearts. Damn, I could have just gone there for hearts. Well, we have to go there anyways, because guess what's over here, guys? Hey, hey, hey. It's another gold sculptula. I think I'm too far for that. Yeah, I'm too far for that. Okay, let me get closer. Boom! There we go. Alright, I think there's only... Yeah, there's only one more we have to get, and I know where it is. Awesome. We're making really fast progress of, like, the of Forest Temple. I mean, seriously. Like, literally, we're, we're pretty much already, like, halfway done with this dungeon already. I mean, seriously, we've gotten a lot done so far. Alright, this right here, guys. This is... Uh, why is my camera freaking out? Uh, this is called a Floor Master. These guys are annoying as hell. You don't want them to really hurt you because they will grab you. And see, if you after you hit them, they split up into three little ones. You gotta really be careful because uh, they will attack you. So just do a quick spin and yeah. Oh my God, shocking! An enemy will attack you. Ooh, they refill your magic. How nice of them. Uh, all right. Now what's in here? I believe this is a small key. Yes, it is. Awesome. Uh, so anyways, guys, uh, I think that just about does it for this video on Ocarina of Time. You've got to see all that extra stuff. Uh, so anyways, next time on Ocarina of Time, we'll hopefully be finishing up the Force Dungeon, because we're pretty much almost done with it. So we'll see you guys next time when we do just that. Oh god, not you again. You've come back for more? Hui Pineapple Custard Pudding! Alright, I'll see you guys next time when we continue more of the Forest Temple. Hopefully, finish it off, because we're almost done with it. I'll see you guys next time.